what are the advantages of laparoscopic surgery over open surgery the incision is small so we need not close it with a stitches we can just close it with a skin glue also patient will be resuming on diet the same day and immediately after going home cosmetically it will be hard to recognize even the person has undergone a surgery what are the advantages of laparoscopic surgery over open surgery so let's start with what we do in an open surgery in an open surgery depending upon the site of hernia a 5 to 10 cm incision will be placed we'll be spreading the tissue we'll be closing the gap in the muscle and we'll be placing a mesh over it and we'll be closing it so just because it is a long incision, we need to place stitches to close it. Because the incision is long, the post-operative pain may be relatively much higher compared to laparoscopic surgery. And because of the pain, the hospital stay may be required for two to three days, depending upon the length of the incision. And after getting discharged from the hospital also, there will be a need of frequent dressings. And once the wound is completely healed, patient need to return to the hospital for stitches removal. Ultimately, it leaves a big scar depending upon the length of the incision in open surgery. When it comes to laparoscopic surgery, what exactly we do in laparoscopic surgery? Laparoscopic surgery is also called as keyhole surgery. We'll be placing three holes over the abdomen. One hole will be one centimeter long and the rest two holes will be 0.5 centimeter long. And through this one centimeter hole, we'll be placing a camera into the abdomen. And to see what all is happening inside the abdomen, we'll be connecting this camera to a video monitor. And thereby, we will be getting a magnified and better clarity vision through the camera. And the rest of the surgery is just like a video game. Through the By seeing the video screen, we'll be completing the rest of the surgery. So what will be the end result of laparoscopic surgery? The incision is small, so we need not close it with a stitches. We can just close it with a skin glue also, kind of fave call for closing the skin. We'll be placing something called as a waterproof dressing at the end of the laparoscopic surgery so that immediately after going home, the patient can have a proper bath with soap and water because there is no risk of infection or there is no need for frequent dressings and there is no need for stitch removal in the future just because the incision is small the post-operative pain also will be less the patient will be able to walk the same day patient will be resuming on diet the same day and immediately after going home there is no need for bed rest at all he can walk as much as he can and he can even climb the stairs he can climb three floors four floors with ease there won't be any need for bed restriction and what is the ultimate end result? Cosmetically, it will be hard to recognize even the person has undergone a surgery or not because such small will be the incision. Return to activity or resuming job will be much faster in patients undergoing laparoscopic surgery compared to patients undergoing open surgery. But the only disadvantage of or the cons of when it comes to cons of laparoscopic surgery just because uh, as we discussed in open surgery we just need the surgical instruments but when it comes to laparoscopic surgery apart from the surgical instrument it's completely technology based we need to have a good quality camera we need to have a good quality monitor for a perfect laparoscopic surgery so compared to open surgery laparoscopic surgery the cost of laparoscopic surgery will be bit on the higher side compared to open surgery. How exactly a laparoscopy a course of hospital stay in a laparoscopic hernia surgery will be. So the patient will be generally admitted a day before the surgery or on the morning of surgery. Once patient gets admitted, we need few blood tests apart from ECG, X-ray, if needed echo for anesthesia purpose. And these test reports may be available in one and a half to two hours after the sample is drawn. Once the report is ready, we can proceed for surgery and the laparoscopic hernia surgery will be done under general anesthesia. What is general anesthesia? The patient will be completely out of conscious and patient won't be feeling any pain during the surgery. The only and only pain the patient will be experiencing during general anesthesia is during insertion of the cannula injection and 
once the cannula is inserted rest all the medicines will be given through the cannula say so there won't be any pain while administering anesthesia to the patient and throughout the surgery he will be just lying like that and he won't be having any pain and once the surgery is finished patient will be immediately out of the anesthesia and he will be kept under observation for 1 to 2 hours in the recovery room and once he is completely conscious enough and once the vitals are all stable he will be shifted to the room post surgery after 4 hours once the patient is completely conscious he will be started on liquid diet on the same day of surgery there is no need for bed restriction if he wants to go to the washroom he can all go by himself right on the day of surgery and there is no need for any bed rest once he is tolerating liquid diet and wall very next day he can be started on the regular diet and daycare discharge if uh, the patient wants to get discharge on the same day if the surgery is performed in the morning he can get discharge on the same day in the evening or the night or he can stay for that night and he can get discharged the very next day but all these applies only in healthy adults the patient has got multiple cardiac issues or renal issues or lung related liver related issues the hospital stay may vary accordingly but mostly the laparoscopic hernia surgery will be a daycare procedure only ikkada pakkana ganapadutunna qr code ni meeru scan chesinatlaite ma whatsapp page lo meer land avtaru and whatsapp dwara meeku guide cheyadam anedi jarugutundi hernia ki sambandhinchina material gurinchi gaani or meeku further em details kavalanna so meeku ganaka ee video nachinatlaite like and share chesi subscribe cheyagalanu korukuntunnanu thank you